the NEC Women's Soccer Championship. Danny Breslauer and former St. Francis goalkeeper Lauren Fear here with you. Number one versus number two, it's St. Francis LIU, the matchup everyone wanted. St. Francis and Long Island University, always a long time rivalry between these two teams. A game full of high intensity and just what everyone wants to see in a championship game. The two time NEC player of the year. What a move to get loose, a rip, and it's off the crossbar. Bicycle kick kept in the area, and Walter is offside as the flag is up. A prestigious honor for the program's all time wins leader. Kaylee Morgan's loose. The ball towards Leon, and Butcher cannot keep it out of the net. Ruby Leon in the 12th minute has sent LIU ahead 1-0. Here you see the goal again. Uh, streaking down the sideline, gets across here, and Leon just steps in front of Brennan and right past Butcher. One-on-one -on -one with the all-NEC defender, Katie Egan. Calderon comes to double. McKibben, the cutback, some space, a shot is wide. Has the number two seed, Long Island University, a 1-0 at top seed St. Francis in the NEC championship. Flick on, spun over to McKibben, brought it down, still room for Tessa McKibben, Jennifer Bannon the save, out in front, it's deflected and saved again by Bannon. Stayrook goes head to head with Young, no whistle. Young, out wide, Spicer, saved by Butcher. Follow up, Leon, save again. Brianna Butcher. Here you see the attempt again. Can't even tell you how hard it is as a goalkeeper to make that first save, get back up, and make another diving save. Collected. McKibben, Flick, Tracy Flick, lays it off. Brennan, wide for Walter. She can serve and does so. Off the crossbar, deflected around and in! Stephanie Bolter again! Her sixth career goal and fourth of the year. Ball. Flick wins the 50-50, shoots, Bannon the save. It's loose for Walter, who cut it back to no one. At the end of 90, the top seed St. Francis won, Long Island won in the Northeast Conference Women's Soccer Championship match. By Alicia McNiff, good defense. The chip, McKibben just waiting for that ball. It's loose now, Ellie Gavin, the volley over the bar. We go to a second overtime. Kaplan, hit straight up in the air and over the bar by Lachlan. Lachlan, the lefty service, found Calderon, deflected in front, still loose. The shot from Kaplan is loose, and Brianna Butcher on top of it. And Three, the NEC two, championship one, will be decided zero. in PKs. Timothy Del Jonovan blows the whistle, Calderon to the ball, shoots, and scores. Brianna Tata, the sophomore midfielder for St. Francis, scores! Right into the right side, guessing wrong. Long approach for her. Maros de Carvalho, and it's into the side of the net. Three tied it to a piece. Morgan's shot is saved by Butcher! Against Jennifer Bannon. Stay Rook shoots, and it's a save! Just like Friday, the opposite goalkeeper responds. Now it's the lefty, Lachlan shoots, and got past Butcher. The sophomore the from Red Hilliard, Lions, Ohio. 24, Ellie Gavin. Gavin, got it. The junior from California, Leon. And she beats Butcher with the outside of her right foot. Aaron Askin. The sophomore forward. Four three LIU, fifth round, Askin to shoot. And LIU will go to the NCAA tournament as Bannon turns away the final PK. The 2011 Northeast Conference Women's Soccer Tournament Most Valuable Player is Jennifer Bannon of Long Island University. <laughs> the Blackbirds of Long Island University. Please come forward and accept your award.
here at the golf field with Long Island keeper Jennifer Bannon, tournament MVP and player of the game. Went down to PKs. How did you feel in that situation? Uh, I felt really confident. We've been working on it all week, um, actually for the past two weeks now, and I had total confidence in all the players on our team that they could bury the ball. And I mean, I just had complete confidence, and I know I could get to some of them. So, All right. Does it add any sort of excitement to you beating St. Francis this year? I mean, coming into it, we wanted to face them in the championship. I mean, they won it last year, fair and square. So uh, coming back, playing them in the championship, uh, I mean, nothing better than beating someone that beat us last year. So it felt great. All right. Thank you very much. Congratulations. All right. I'm here at the golf field with NEC champion coach Tracy Bartholomew of Long Island. How do you feel this year being on this side? I'll tell you what. We've been in a few championships, and walking away losing just hurts the heart. And you know, to see these kids respond, it's been a, a long year. We started back, we were one and two in conference, and we've just spun on a winning streak, and it's been a great ride right now. This is great. <laughs> All right, what are you going to prepare to do for the NCAA tournament? Well, we're going to have to recover, get back on that bus. As you know, you took that trip last year. So, you know, and then we'll, we'll wait to see. The girls are really excited. We've been working very hard for this, and, you know, I just... Also, want to say St. Francis just such a class act, great program, and I know they were play had such a great game, and just you know want to thank them for everything they did here too. All right, thanks so much, Coach. Good luck next week. Long Island University, the NEC Women's Soccer Champions in 2011. The tournament's most outstanding player was Jennifer, Jennifer Bannon, the goalkeeper for LIU. She stopped this shot from Aaron Askin. And that put LIU into the field of the NCAA tournament with a 4-3 win in PKs over the top seed St. Francis Red Flash. For Lauren Fear and our producer director, Norm Harnick, our entire PAC Network crew, I'm Danny Breslauer. The proceeding has been a PAC Network production. To learn more, log on to pacnetwork.com. Once again, the final score, 1-1, and LIU advances as the NEC champion, 4-3 on penalty kicks. So long from Loretto, Pennsylvania. Have a good night.